Have you ever wondered how those long ridge drainage pipes are made and why they're so essential for modern infrastructure? Corrugated polyethylene pipes are everywhere, hidden beneath roads, managing stormwater, and protecting cities from floods. But how exactly are these durable, lightweight pipes manufactured? In this video, we take you inside the fascinating world of pipe production, where high-density polyethylene HDPE pellets are transformed into strong, flexible drainage systems. From raw materials to extrusion, corrugation, and final quality testing, you'll see the entire process step by step. These pipes may look simple, but their engineering and durability make them an essential part of modern infrastructure. If you love behind-the-scenes factory tours and want to learn how everyday items are made, be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Now, let's dive into the incredible process of making corrugated polyethylene pipes. The Making of Drainage Pipes Drainage pipes are an essential component of modern infrastructure, playing a crucial role in various industries including construction, agriculture, and environmental management. These pipes help prevent urban flooding by efficiently channeling rainwater away from streets and buildings, ensuring the smooth operation of municipal drainage systems. In the forestry industry, they serve as culverts for logging roads, allowing water to flow under roadways and reducing environmental disruption. Over the years, plastic drainage pipes have gained popularity due to their durability, lightweight nature, and cost-effectiveness. Among the different materials used for manufacturing drainage pipes, high-density polyethylene, HDPE, is one of the most widely used options. This thermoplastic polymer is known for its exceptional strength, corrosion resistance, and flexibility, making it ideal for underground installations and long-term use. The manufacturing of HDPE drainage pipes involves several intricate steps, from processing raw materials to quality control testing. This article provides an in-depth look at the entire production process, highlighting the technological advancements that make these pipes a key part of modern infrastructure. Raw Materials the production of HDPE drainage pipes begins with the selection of raw materials. The primary component is high-density polyethylene, a durable and chemically resistant plastic ideal for various applications. The factory sources HDPE in the form of small pellets, which are carefully blended to achieve the desired composition for pipe manufacturing. A standard HDPE mix includes three types of pellets, virgin HDPE resin, recycled HDPE, and UV-protected HDPE. Virgin HDPE provides the necessary structural integrity, ensuring the pipe is strong enough to withstand external pressure. Recycled HDPE is an environmentally friendly and cost-effective alternative that helps reduce plastic waste. Meanwhile, UV-protected HDPE pellets contain special additives that shield the pipe from sunlight, preventing degradation when exposed to outdoor conditions. The proportions of these materials vary depending on the pipe's intended application. For example, pipes used in underground drainage systems may contain a higher percentage of recycled plastic, while those exposed to sunlight require enhanced UV protection. After the raw materials are carefully measured, they are transferred into a mixing chamber, where they are thoroughly blended to ensure a uniform composition before being sent to the extrusion system. Extrusion The extrusion process is the first major step in transforming HDPE pellets into a functional drainage pipe. In this phase, the blended pellets are heated to approximately 230 degrees Celsius, 446 degrees Fahrenheit, inside an extruder, a machine designed to melt and shape plastic. The extruder consists of a long cylindrical barrel with a rotating screw inside. As the screw turns, it pushes the melted plastic forward, maintaining consistent temperature and pressure to ensure an even flow. This controlled movement is crucial in preventing air pockets and achieving uniform pipe thickness. Once the HDPE reaches the desired molten consistency, it is directed toward the next stage of the process corrugation. This step is what gives the drainage pipe its distinctive ridged shape, which enhances flexibility and load-bearing capacity. Corrugation Corrugated drainage pipes are known for their wave-like ridges, which improve their ability to withstand external pressure while maintaining flexibility. 
The formation of these ridges occurs inside a specialized mold known as the corrugator. As the molten HDPE enters the corrugator, vacuum pressure is applied to distribute the plastic evenly into the mold's ridges and grooves. This vacuum process ensures that every section of the pipe takes on the correct shape, preventing defects such as uneven walls or weak spots. To further reinforce the pipe structure, a built-in cooling system immediately begins solidifying the plastic as it takes shape. This prevents the newly formed pipe from deforming before it moves to the next production phase. As the mold moves along the production line, the hardened pipe is carefully extracted and directed to a cooling chamber for further stabilization. Cooling Process once the pipe has been shaped, it undergoes a cooling process to fully harden the plastic and stabilize its structure. The pipe passes through a cold water shower where jets of chilled water rapidly reduce its temperature. This cooling process is critical for several reasons. First, it prevents warping or sagging by ensuring the plastic hardens uniformly. Second, it enhances the pipe's structural integrity, allowing it to maintain its intended shape under pressure. Finally, it ensures the pipe meets standard dimensions, which is essential for proper fittings and connections during installation. After cooling, the pipe is ready for further modifications, such as perforation and protective wrapping, to enhance its drainage efficiency. Perforation In many drainage applications, perforated pipes are essential for efficient water management. These pipes feature small holes around their circumference, which serve two crucial purposes. First, the perforations help reduce the pipe's overall weight, making transportation and installation easier. Second, they allow water to enter from multiple points along the pipe, improving drainage efficiency by ensuring continuous water flow to the outlet. To achieve precision, manufacturers use specialized perforation machines that punch uniformly sized holes into the pipe based on strict specifications. The size, shape, and spacing of these perforations vary depending on the pipe's intended use. For example, pipes used for agricultural irrigation may have a different hole pattern than those used in municipal drainage systems where water flow requirements and soil conditions differ. Despite their benefits, perforations can create a potential challenge. Soil, debris, and sediment may gradually accumulate inside the pipe, clogging the openings and restricting water flow. This issue can compromise the pipe's functionality and reduce its lifespan. Applying the filter cloth. To maintain optimal drainage performance and prevent clogging, perforated pipes are wrapped in a durable polyester filter cloth. This specialized fabric acts as a protective barrier, allowing water to flow freely into the pipe while blocking soil, sediment, and debris. Without this protective layer, fine particles could gradually accumulate inside the perforations, reducing the pipe's efficiency and leading to blockages that compromise the entire drainage system. The wrapping process is highly automated to ensure precision and consistency. The pipe is fed into a specialized wrapping machine, which carefully rolls the polyester cloth around its exterior. The fabric is applied with the right amount of tension to ensure full coverage while maintaining the pipe's flexibility. To prevent unraveling over time, the edges of the cloth are heat sealed, creating a strong bond that keeps the protective layer intact even under harsh environmental conditions. This added layer of protection significantly enhances the pipe's durability, making it suitable for a wide range of applications, including agricultural drainage, municipal stormwater management, and construction projects. Packaging and Shipping once the drainage pipe has undergone all necessary modifications, it moves to the final stage of production packaging and shipping. This critical step ensures that the pipes are properly coiled, secured, and protected for storage and transportation to customers. Given that these pipes are often used in large-scale infrastructure projects, proper packaging is essential to maintain their structural integrity and prevent any damage during transit. The process begins with an automated coiling system that carefully winds the pipe according to the customer's specifications. The machine ensures that each coil is uniform in size and tightly wound to prevent deformation. After coiling, the system cuts the pipe to the required length, ensuring precise measurements for each order. 
To keep the coils intact and prevent them from unraveling, they are secured at multiple points with durable ties. To further safeguard the pipes, they are wrapped in a protective plastic covering. This layer shields the pipes from dirt, moisture, and UV exposure, preventing any potential degradation before installation. Since many drainage pipes are stored outdoors before use, this extra layer of protection helps maintain their quality and longevity. Once packaged, the coiled pipes are loaded onto trucks and prepared for distribution. Advanced Drainage Pipe Designs While traditional corrugated drainage pipes are widely used, some manufacturers produce advanced designs, such as double wall pipes, to enhance performance and durability. These specialized pipes feature a two-layer construction that combines strength and efficiency, making them ideal for high-volume drainage systems. The key advantage of double-wall pipes lies in their unique structure. The outer layer is corrugated, providing exceptional structural strength and resistance to external pressures. This design allows the pipe to withstand heavy loads, making it suitable for underground applications where soil weight and vehicle traffic could otherwise cause damage. Meanwhile, the inner layer is smooth, which significantly improves hydraulic performance. Water flows more efficiently through the pipe since it encounters less resistance compared to the ridge surface of a standard corrugated pipe. This also helps minimize sediment buildup, reducing the risk of blockages over time. Quality Control before HDPE drainage pipes are approved for sale and distribution, they must undergo a series of rigorous quality control tests to ensure they meet industry standards for strength, flexibility, and durability. These tests are critical in guaranteeing that the pipes can perform reliably in demanding environments, from municipal drainage systems to large-scale construction projects. One of the most important tests is compression strength testing, which evaluates the pipe's ability to withstand external pressure, such as the weight of soil and heavy loads placed on top of it. Since many drainage pipes are installed underground, they must resist deformation and maintain their structural integrity under immense pressure. Another essential test is flexibility testing, which ensures that the pipe can bend without cracking. This is crucial for installation in areas where the ground may shift or settle over time. The pipe must be able to withstand bending and movement while maintaining its performance. From raw material processing to final packaging, the production of HDPE drainage pipes is a highly advanced and automated process. These pipes are essential for infrastructure projects worldwide, providing a lightweight yet durable alternative to traditional materials like concrete and metal. With ongoing advancements in material science and manufacturing technology, drainage pipes are becoming more efficient, environmentally friendly, and cost-effective. Whether used for municipal drainage, agricultural irrigation, or road construction, HDPE pipes continue to be a cornerstone of modern water management solutions. And that's a wrap on the fascinating journey of how corrugated polyethylene pipes are made. From raw materials to the final product, each step in the process is designed to ensure durability, efficiency, and long-lasting performance. Whether for drainage systems, agriculture, or construction, these pipes play a vital role in infrastructure worldwide. If you found this process as interesting as we did, don't forget to like, comment, and share this video. Be sure to subscribe for more behind-the-scenes looks at how everyday products are made. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.